Repeat, if you have an appointment, please contact the testing center. Ooh, a laser wall. That's some serious security. Honey, you're back. What took you so long? I was... Ugh, just give me laser protection. Oh, so brutal. I'm shaking. All right, I get it. You'll get your polymer and your precious components. Just install the laser protection already. Whatever you say. Your defense system is active. Thing packs a punch. I almost bought the farm there. Are you okay? Is everything ready? Did you pull it off? Don't worry, honey. I'm right as rain. The operation was totally painless. Good. You need to leave right now. There's a man coming for you. He's armed and wearing an experimental polymer glove. Must be such enough, Sky. Larissa, did you talk to him? Well, you should have. It would have saved us a whole lot of trouble. That scares me when you talk like that. I'll meet you at the exit. I'm right behind you, honey. I just hope we're not too late. Hope can be dangerous. Hands up! Victor? What's going on? You deaf? Hands behind your head. Victor! The hell Victor! are you? Major Nachaya Special Operations, and that's the last question you get. You're going to Chelame. Save yourself! Chelame. Of course, Comrade Major. Intrusion. Huh? Intrusion! Hey, freeze! Damn it! Red alert. Lock down the car. Dmitry Bagram, previously convicted for slandering the Communist Party, has officially paid his debt to the motherland and is thus granted relief from forced labor at the Communist Party. Robots around. It's almost like there is property. I locked the goddamn door. Petrov ran off with a mobile power source called a candle. It powers the emergency lockdown system. This door cannot be opened without a candle. Now I'll find another one. There's got to be more than one candle in this complex, right? We need to hurry. Otherwise, Petrov will escape the sector and we'll have to track him down again.
Charles, what's that birch tree encased in glass in the room down there? Is it the famous PEC-4 power generator? Indeed it is. The birch tree PEC-4 is a vegetative polymer-based power generator. It's an experimental model. The first step of our program to conquer the distant planets of the solar system. have to carry it like this the candle is a complex unstable piece of equipment it cannot be stored in your backpack along with your other items there is a high probability of mutual destructuralization like an explosion not necessarily but the candle would be disabled so I'll have to carry it like this got it the candle is quite durable you can drop it or even throw it intentionally nothing will happen to it mm-hmm Genetic analysis results are considered unofficial and cannot be presented as a valid document. 10% of cases require a follow-up analysis a week later. <laughs> Those loaders are going nuts. Is this Petrov's doing? Be careful. Loaders are extremely durable. You won't be able to damage them with a simple axe. Shock therapy usually works pretty well on nutcases, metallic or otherwise. Will it be major?
Looks like there was a containment breach in the out. Hold on. I just lost my train of thought. I've been watching for you for so long. 67A. Convicted of the unauthorized distribution of confidential data is ordered to report to social control. You were going on and on about It looks about like there was a containment right? breach in the algae workshop, and experimental materials leaked out. That's actually good for us. Open once all the holes have canisters of lunar soil in them. You may have sure love your fancy locks, don't you? Guess I'll go find some canisters. It's a weird song, but I like the girl's voice. Is that a radio of the future? Indeed it is. Professor Lebedev of the Academy of Consequences has developed a non-linear algorithm based on the principles of non-commutative quantum mathematics. Charles. Yes? Who are you just talking to? Forgive me. I'll explain it in terms you can understand. Hey. Hold on. some of the samples, specifically the pioneering first five. Not that batshit lady robot perv again. I'll go around her. Not so there you are, sugar. Oh, I missed you so much. Have you dumped that stupid glove yet? Uh, don't count on it. I love it when you get angry. Yes, yes, scold me, punish me. I was a bad girl and strung up another disgusting creep. What? You killed someone again? You monster. But you haven't entered me for so long, big guy. I was so lonely. I had to blow off some steam. social credit is now beginning. Regular personnel are to remain at their workstations. It looks like there was a containment breach in Bad timing. Yeah. 
So what were you saying? It looks like there was a containment breach in the algae workshop. And experimental material. Hold on. I just lost my train of thought. Where were we? It looks like there was a containment breach in the algae workshop. An experimental material. I've got one. It's a weird song, but I like the girl's voice. Is that a radio of the future? Indeed it is. Professor Lebedev of the Academy of Consequences has developed a non-linear algorithm based on the principles of non-commutative quantum mathematics. Charles. Yes? Who are you just talking to? Forgive me. I'll explain it in terms you can understand. The Academy of Consequences has found a way to calculate musical radio waves from the future. Hey. Hold on. Stand down, Agent. You're out of line. as a valid document. 10% of cases require a follow-up. Not that batshit lady robot perv again. I'll go around her. There you are, sugar. There it is. Oh, I missed you so much. Have you dumped that stupid glove yet? Uh, don't count on it. I love it when you get angry. Yes, yes, scold me, punish me. I was a bad girl and strung up another disgusting creep. What? You killed Do you like it, sugar? I did my best. This is cool. For real. <gasps> Charles, what does Petrov need with the repair vendor? Why would the sicko try to take control of Nora? Why would he even need weapons? He's got robots fighting for him. The traitor realized that employees confronted with hostile robots will defend themselves. And the soldiers defending the facility will attempt to get more powerful weapons. He must have been scared someone would bump into him by accident and shoot him like the traitorous piece of dog shit he is. That very well may be. Regardless, Petrov was unable to get his hands on a repair vendor. However, Laura's algorithms were still corrupted in a most hideous manner. <sighs> that dirty son of a whore. The repair vendor is completely insane. He's got her saying all kinds of creepy sex shit and making goofy junk instead of decent weapons. And she kills people. Does that mean we'll have to go unarmed? Uh, anything's better than nothing, right? I'd rather take on a robot with a metal toilet brush than my bare hands. I've got another one. Now for the... Uh, done. I think it worked. Whew, this place is huge, and it's got Sechenov's name written all over it. Thank so, where are we? This is the seed bank, the heart of the Vavilov complex. Samples of seeds from all manner of plants are stored here so they can be cultivated to grow on the moon and Mars. These stunning and unique experiments are in danger of being lost. Crispy critters! They're most certainly crispy nature. Shut up, Charles. No time for this. Warning. Microclimate abnormality detected inside the bank. Sample container integrity compromised.
Rocket! I hope she's asleep.
3267A, convicted of the unauthorized distribution of confidential data, is ordered to report to social... Attention. New applications can now be submitted for not working. By social credit employees only.
I know you're here, Petrov. You've got nowhere to run. You were going give you on ten and on seconds about to surrender. Something, right? According to biometric readings, this is Petrov. It is? Crispy critters. Shit. It really is Petrov. Uh, I had a feeling it'd end this way. Wizard, this is P3. Come in. Wizard here. Have you found Petrov, my boy? I found his body. He's been decapitated. A loader turned his skull into blood pudding. Damn. His head contained codes I would have used to end this nightmare quickly. I'm sorry, Dr. Sechenov. I was too late. <sighs> then we'll have to solve the problem another way. Did he have any rings on him? Two gold rings? Uh, no rings, sir. Just a candle. Understood. I need you to report to the VDNH at once, B3. We've got bigger problems than Petrov to deal with. What could be worse than Petrov? Stockhausen will debrief you at the VDNH. Hurry. Time is of the essence. Do I make myself clear, my lord? 10-4, wizard. Moving out.
four power generator microclimate readings are suboptimal. Electricity generation not possible. The door's locked. We won't be able to open it without power. What are you saying? The energy from the candles isn't sufficient to power the main gate, but installing them activated a system that provides special polymers to the Birch Tree Life Support System. The Life Support System has four primary functions. Maintaining optimal temperature, eliminating insects... In other words, four columns, four canisters... Exactly. Each canister contains a unique polymer. Polymers are manufactured in workshops where they are poured into these canisters. Why couldn't they just make, like, a normal door? Ugh, guess I gotta go find some canisters. Fading data. So, what do you think about our birch tree, sugar? The one in the humongous glass thing? What about it? She's holding out for a hero, just like I do. Waiting for someone to save her from the biting cold. Oh, that's it. Enough. One deranged tin can is plenty for me. I knew you would stay loyal to me, handsome. Take off the glove, and we'll be together forever. Don't hold your breath. So, why is this birch tree so important? It's not important at all, Stud. You'll have to warm her up, but you can ignore her. She's a dumb tree. Nothing like me. Crispy critters. At least the tree doesn't talk. You would be lonely without me, Shivan. Would I really? Holy shit. Where did all these monsters come from? A mere hypothesis. But I suspect they're the bodies of dead soldiers that have been... Did by Sprouts. A fuck. Orthesis, are you shitting me? It's merely my own determination. This has never happened before. Fuck me. So how did it happen? I guess that something went wrong with the Sprouts after the job caused the malfunction. Minutes spent at lunch is a minute stolen from the people.